Hello again YouTube, it is Mitch from Firestone Tutorials and here's a tutorial that I've been meaning to make for a while. Uh, I'm going to go into detail about the different kinds of redstone pulsers. I mentioned that I was going to be doing that in a previous video and I never got around to it so here's the tutorial for that. I do need some things though. So I'm going to get my redstone, get, let's see, a couple of diodes, going to need levers, redstone torches, why not, and that's about it, just kind of demonstration, okay. So, start off, I'm going to show you how to make that uh, rapid pulser that I showed in the original automatic turret, um, and really it's just, if you put two blocks like this, then a block in between, that's really the only block setup, and then all you have to do is put torches like I placed them here, so two on the front side, and then two on the back side, or it doesn't really matter which side they are, you can have either side active, and then make a line of redstone down through the center, so that it's three lines of redstone to, so that it goes through like this, and then put some redstone on top, like this, and it'll flash. And then you can link this up to basically whatever you want, and um, just to kind of show some of the features of it, you can throw a lever, lever out here, as I showed in the other video. And if you turn on the lever, it actually turns off the repeater. So that's one stun, uh, one type of repeater. I prefer that repeater because it's um, fairly, you know, compact. You can pretty much put it anywhere, and it'll give a, a you know, a decent current. And there's not much you have to do to start it. You can just kind of put redstone. Uh, the other one is I guess a little bit more complex, it involves a little bit more timing and that is made by just basically by making a I guess like a cross with redstone dials so that the current will actually go in a circle and then it's so like the opened end is down here so that means that the current will travel this way if you will so then you draw a line backwards and you do that for every single one of these I don't think you have to do it for every single one of these but I know that's how I was taught to make it. And then, with this, um, the only thing you have to do is you have to jump start it with a redstone torch. So basically, I'm going to drop a torch and then destroy it real quick, and it's going to be kind of hard to see. So, let's see if I can do this first try here. Yep, yeah, there you go. And that just keeps going around in a circle. And here, to show you what would happen if you don't take the torch out fast enough, it the entire thing will light up and then it won't keep going. So the trick is if you can kind of see this, if you watch really closely when I put a torch down, the current starts to go around. And the key is that you have to place, or you have to destroy the torch before the current goes all the way around and gets back here. And once it makes that complete circuit, it's just going to stay lit. So, real quick, just to demonstrate. There you go. And it's back up again. And then you can actually take off these end pieces and I mean, you can lead it off in whatever direction you want. Um, which I guess would be kind of nice for having like multi directional uh, currents or pulsers. And that's that. And it's pretty simple, straightforward. Um, I will give you a hint though on multiplayer, it tends to lag, so that'd be kind of difficult. Um, and also, these, if you put a lever on here to stop the current for a while, or. Uh, oops build this real quick. You know, if you, you know, I want to try something here. I think you can do this. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so see if I put like a lever over here. Or, yeah. So like if I wanted to delay the current, like turn this thing off, uh, and I turned on the lever, and you can't turn it back off again. So it's basically lit, so then you have to jump start it again, take these out, and this here, and then jump start it again. Or jump start it right instead of wrong. Um, there, and back up and running. So this one, the only thing I don't like about it is it's actually a little bit slower if you look at the comparison. Like that's really fast, and that's kind of slow. Just because it seems kind of strange, but redstone repeaters, even on their um, lowest setting, actually do delay the current a little bit, um, which is actually the reason why this is possible. Um, so anyway, I hope that helped. Um, 
Anyway, that is all. So, thanks for watching.